Hey Scorpios, and welcome back for another Scorpio Love reading. Scorpio, this is going to be your bonus reading here. Uh, it is also a general, so it's not going to resonate for every single Scorpio out there. Uh, shout out to all of the beautiful Scorpios of the world. Uh, you bring light to a dark place, Scorpios, but if they push you wrong, you can also bring darkness to a light place. <laughs> okay? It depends, Scorpio. It certainly does depend. So let's tap into the energy and see what's going on with whoever is coming towards you. Or let, let's check out you first, Spirit. What is going on with Scorpios pertaining to love? Uh, what type of energy is Scorpio in pertaining to love? Here, Spirit, show me Scorpio's energy in love. Spirit, how does Scorpio feel uh, towards love? Scorpio, whoever it is, past, new, now, love. What is it? Beginnings here. So this is what you feel about love. Okay. So you say new direction, fresh start, a fresh chance. So see, this is the energy you're in, new beginnings here. So you say you, you don't want nothing. Oh, you want something new. You want a fresh start here. You want something that has not been tainted with the world's mess here. I feel like you want something clean and wholesome here. Ooh, so you in beginnings. All right, Spirit, who is coming towards Scorpio and what is their energy in here? Show me the energy of the person who is coming towards Scorpio in love, romance, energy here, spirit. Spirit, who is this person and what are they coming in the energy of towards my beautiful, amazing Scorpios here? So let's see here. What is that? You have longing. Mm. Oh, longing, aching, pinning, pining, past love. So someone is longing for you. <laughs> ah, you got me yearning. Somebody is yearning for your love, honey. They're yearning for your touch. Is this a tattoo? Someone could love uh, running their tongue down your... Look, don't come for me. This Scorpio reading, god dang it. Someone could really, really, in, uh, really uh, remember... A certain uh, someone could really be infatuated with uh, your art, your your uh, your tattoos, or just your style here. Like you're so poetic, you just got this eclectic eclectic type of style, and someone hasn't been able to find it anywhere else, and they are longing for you. And for some of y'all, you like yeah yeah yeah, but uh, I I think I'm, I I I want to start some else somewhere else here, Scorpio. Someone could be concealing here, hiding secrets. I feel like someone is hiding that they are longing for you, Scorpio. I feel like someone is hiding that they are hiding, uh, and you feel like you're better off. <laughs> See? See, and I ain't going to go too deep in these because I'm going to pull these same tarot cards because this is your extended, so we're going to keep that same energy. And it says that, uh, so whoever this is coming to you, Scorpio, this is how you feel towards them. You feel like you're better off here because now you have a clear head space. You have a fresh new perspective and you're happier here. And it's because you're choosing something different. You want a new beginning. You want something new. You don't want anything old. You want to start something fresh and new. Uh, you want something that, and, and even if it just so happens that, that, that your wishes may be with someone that you've been with before, a past person, you don't want it to be the same like it used to be, God dang it. You want beginnings. You want you want that old love back. You want you, you want y'all to be like you was when you first met. You want that innocent, high vibrational love vibes that you guys shared with one another here, Scorpio. Because while you're moving in a different direction, they're sitting here behind the scenes, not, not expressing their feelings for you, hiding how they feel, hiding that they're missing you, that they're longing for you. And they're hiding that this is someone here who doesn't show their emotions a lot. And this is what's in the middle of you, two of you, Scorpio. This is the this is what's going on. It says time, wait. Cycles infinite, infinite, infinity. My bad. Time is all about timing. That's between you and whoever this person is. It's all about timing here. It says wait cycles infinity. So it's almost like it's not time because someone still needs to heal or 
however this time is it could be that that you are choosing to it could it could be that your person is waiting but i feel like you are choosing to close out a cycle because you want a new beginning you don't want to repeat a cycle here and i feel like your person is in this weight energy because after all they're not even they're concealing how they really feel here scorpio and that's just what i feel is going on so let's see here all right, Spirit, show me the energy for Scorpio in, this, in their person here for this extended energy, Spirit. What's going on here with Scorpio in their person here? Let's see here. All right, Spirit, give me three cards for Scorpio. How is Scorpio feeling towards, Scorpio, towards their person or towards love, Spirit? Show me Scorpio, Spirit. going on with Scorpio mm. seven of pentacles for you Scorpios <clears throat> on your side what else for Scorpio? So I feel like you're you're ready to invest, but you want growth. You want progress here. You could be waiting for the right connection to grow, or you could have been waiting for someone and you're tired of waiting on them. I feel like that's what it is because you want something new here. King of Wands, some of you guys are dealing with the King of Wands, or some of you guys just want to take action. The Hermit card, I feel like you guys are staying to yourself. Or, you, or you're just soul searching here because I feel like you're moving in a different direction and you want answers because you don't want to make the same mistakes here, Scorpio. So I feel like you're trying to figure out what should you do in your life where love is concerned. And it could be about this person too because it's almost like some of you guys may be about to wait here. You got the Knight of Wands on your side, Scorpio, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries here. See, it could be that you're trying to figure out what this person's going to do here, what someone wants to do. You could be trying. You could be uh, trying to figure out if someone intentions pure or not, because you got the seven of pentacles. It's almost like you may be waiting on somebody here, Scorpio, waiting to see. Because it does say time does say wait cycles in infinity. So for some of you Scorpios, you may get tired of waiting for someone. Especially you may be getting tired of waiting on someone to change something here. But I feel like you really don't know what to do about it, especially if someone may have brought, brought you happy, made, uh, made you happy. But some of you guys are realizing that you're better off away from this connection. Because I feel like it's, it's, it wasn't good. I feel like someone was hiding their emotions. Someone was hiding secrets. They were too busy hiding things. You was trying to figure out how they felt. So all right, Spirit, who is this person coming to a Scorpio? Give me three cards. Mm. See, seven of swords that they go hiding and concealing again. Look how he's sitting around here like he about to peep around the corner. See, there they go hiding things again, Scorpio. Spirit, show me, Scorpio. It could be a Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius here, Spirit. Show me what's going on in Scorpio's person here, Spirit. What's this? Ooh, what are they hiding here? They go that Wheel of Fortune here. They're hiding karma. Somebody could be going through some things because check it out. The will of fortune is in the reverse. And I'm going to take it just like that. Someone may be hiding out from you, not letting you know how they feel, Scorpio, because they are going through something. Ooh, death. Could be another Scorpio. Somebody is going through a horrible end. Or maybe they're going through a transformation. They feel like, I feel like for some of you Scorpios, if you've left someone here, especially if this is your, this is your energy, if it's not another Scorpio, you leaving someone here, feeling like you're better off because, see, you don't have their burden on you. I feel like you have been enlightened. You understand about the connection with this person. I feel like you feel like you would just be waiting on them to commit to you because we know the Knight of Wands here is somebody here who is flighty. You know, they, they, they rush in passionately, but, it, you know, it doesn't take a lot to keep the. It takes a lot to keep their interest or they're going to be off again here because, this is what they do. They, they, they don't know how to release their passion any other way because I feel like this is what it's about. And I feel like with this hermit card, you guys have just been trying to uh, soul search and figure out what should you do because I feel like for some of you guys, you may have cared for this person, but at the same time, I feel like you're tired of waiting on this person because like I say, the mutual energy between the two of you is time. 
It says weight cycles infinity here, time. And I feel like with the seven of pentacles on your side, you, you probably have, have invested and you were hoping that something came out of it. But I feel like you're realizing that you just want a fresh start here. You just want to, you feel like you're going to be better off because this person may have had you in your head. And like over here, I feel like since you did, since you are uh, moving in a different direction, I feel like you ended it with this person. You ended it because this is your energy. And like I said here, you could have ended it with this person once again because maybe this person, like the cards say here, they longing for you now because you left them. But at first, this person was concealing a lot of things. They were hiding things here. It says secrets, mysteries, hiding. And I'd be God dang if that seven of swords didn't come back out. So see, this is why you ended it with this person because you couldn't handle the lies here. Now this person's realizing that their luck has turned for the worse since Scorpio ended it with them. Okay, <laughs> right. Now all they left to do is to secretly, quietly, long for you because some of y'all long gone okay they longing for you while you long gone <laughs> oh snap scrubber they longing for you baby but you long gone <laughs> that, 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 that's what we're gonna say there all right spirit give me two more cards for scorpio here me, let me pull two more cards for each we get five each and then i clarify all right spirit see some of you guys feel like you don't want this person's offer or you're just going to take that L and say, okay, well, I just missed an opportunity here. All right, Spirit, what else for Scorpio side, Spirit? What's going on with Scorpio? How does Scorpio feel? Mm. Scorpio say Scorpio wants something long-term. See there? That was in your other reading. See? You say you want something that's going to last. You, you tired for these in it. You say you be god dang if you settle for another end and out situation here. If they don't come in here and, and, and be willing to stay with you till y'all take y'all last breath, then you're not interested. <laughs> See, y'all want a relationship. Go on and spit that shit, god dang me. And I feel like y'all mean that, god dang me. Y'all y'all not playing. You're not backtracking. If you can't have this, you, I feel like some of y'all obsess over it too. And some of y'all may be dealing with the Capricorn here too. But it could be this person who is full of regret now in this five of cups. Like I said, it's them. I just remembered. Because their luck has turned. See, the will of fortune is in the reverse. So now this person is in a very bad place now, but it's because of their own doing here because they were hiding, they were secretive, they were hiding a lot of things, not just their emotions, but with that seven of swords, who knows what they were having. But we're about to clarify here. So let's see two more cards over here for Scorpio's person here. Two more cards. I see Capricorn, I see Scorpio, I see Taurus, I see Virgo, I see Taurus. All right, Spirit, give me two more cards. For Scorpio's person. How are they feeling about Scorpio here? See? They in that four of cups. <laughs> They're the ones feeling like they done missed an opportunity or they feel like if they come that you don't want them. Because especially, especially when they didn't come to offer much of anything, but they wanted. They didn't use that one. You know, you know, this is somebody here who is in route, always traveling. So no telling what they didn't use that one. They didn't use that one in just about every area code. And they expect for you to be happy with that used community one. <laughs> they could at least stop and bought a new one or did something here. All right, Spirit, one more card for Scorpio's person here. What came out? Mm. Knight of Pentacles here. But that's in the reverse here. I feel like this person ain't doing it. Or maybe this person wants to do something now since it's in the reverse here. I feel like this person wants to do something now, but I feel like it's too late. See, eight of wands here. I feel like there is no movement here. I feel like this person want to do something now, Scorpio, but they, they want to do it after the fact. I feel like it's just too late. I just feel like it's a too late. When you when you hide a lot of things and you intentionally hide things, that 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 rubs people the wrong way. How can people, how can anyone trust you? No one can trust that. So let's see. Let's start off over here with your side, Scorpio. All right, Spirit. Clarify Scorpio's side. Yeah, once you, once you realize that there's no trust, you ain't got nothing. You don't have anything, let alone a, a long term. You're not even going to get there, especially when you're dealing with the Knight of Wands energy. With the Seven of Swords energy. Oh, no. 
you already know that ain't going to work. But I feel like being that the true Scorpio you are, you always try to see the good in things. But I feel like you're realizing now you're better off without this because this ain't doing nothing bringing you down. So you got the five of, five of cups in the reverse underneath the bottom here. So all right, Spirit, why is the seven of pentacles here for Scorpio, Spirit? Clarify the seven of pentacles for Scorpios. Seven of Pentacles, the Ten of Wands. I feel like you're releasing this burden of waiting. I feel like this person had you on a roller coaster ride. That's why you got cycles here, time. Because you were too busy hoping for the best at this person. Seven of Wands with the Ten of Wands, but you like Seven of Pentacles, you was waiting, hoping that something could really grow out of this, but you realized it was just a burden. <laughs> because you was waiting in vain for some of y'all. Some of y'all realized that you were waiting in vain, that this person wasn't going to do nothing here, Scorpio. Six of Pentacles in the reverse, they wasn't willing to give. They wasn't willing to give because I feel like in the past they was taking their own sweet time. Uh, uh, but, but I feel like in the reverse here, it could represent that they want to come do something now. But anyway, the Seven of Pentacles for Scorpio Wise is here. Ace of Wands here in the reverse here. Because I feel like you didn't get out of it what you wanted to get out of it, Scorpio. You wanted something new. You wanted something to be amazing. You may have thought that there was going to be passion, a new beginning in passion with you too. That this was a great new beginning with this person. But you realize that for some of you, Scorpios, you found out that all this person wanted was just intimacy here. You thought that you was waiting to build with the Seven of Pentacles, but you realized that it wasn't all this person wanted was just to bring you the one, Scorpio. And you realize that this is all it was, was just a one relationship, Scorpio. All right, Spirit, for Scorpio, why is this hermit card here? Scorpio, you could be dealing with the Virgo here. Spirit, clarify the hermit for Scorpio. Why is this here? Clarify the hermit. I feel like y'all had to soul search about this connection here because, you know, like I say, I always say with this Ace of Wands here, I feel like you realize that all this Knight of Wands was bringing in was intimacy. And, you know, a lot of times we get stuck, especially if it feel good. Now, let's keep it real. Sometimes you, you have some good intimacy with somebody. You, it's just good to you. Let's just call it like that. But that is a trap, too. Because that's all, sometimes that's all they be wanting. But in Scorpio's illusions, you think that just because the intimacy is so good that it, that, that surely they, they catching feelings, but some of them just really don't. They just, they just, I'm just learning because it just seems like these men, they, they'd be all in with the intimacy as if you the only specimen in the world, but when that intimacy is over, you ain't got nothing with that person. And that's a harsh reality, but sometimes it just be that way. And I feel like this is what you see, this is what you, you found out, especially with this hermit card. I feel like you had to tap in because you probably was confusing. You probably like, well, God dang, this person be walking the dog. This person be standing up in me. <laughs> They be writing their name, their, their first name, the middle name, the last name, the social security number, all up and through me <laughs> when we're there. But when we're not there, it's like this person don't even know me. I write the hermit card for Scorpio Spirit. Why is this here? See, the Knight of Cups here. I feel like you were trying to figure out was this person sincere emotionally or were they just running game? And I feel like you realize this person was just playing on your emotions, Scorpio, just feeding your ego. It was good to them when they was getting the intimacy. But like I said, I feel like this person, see, you found out this person really wasn't about nothing. They were just full of it. See, you found out this person is just faking the funk. You like, God dang, I thought this was real. It felt real this whole time. You really didn't like me like that. Because, you know, it just ama it, it, it amazes me. Just, you can tell men are from another planet than us because they can be so intimate into you. I'm talking about really be into you, but not really be into you, but still be with you intimately. I don't know. I ain't made like that, but you run into people that are like that every day, and it just goes to show. 
when people start showing you who they are, there's no need in, in trying to prove that they don't know who they are. It's just now as harsh a reality as it may be. If they if they mess around and show you who they really are, spirits say that's just who it is. And we just we just get into a place where we're having to accept it. Especially in your intuition. You know your spirit gonna show you them red flags here. But sometimes the intimacy be so good and you be hoping it ain't is you be hoping that it's a little bit more than what you what you know than than just this, but you finding out it was it was just all of that. But you, but you, that's why they're longing for you. Ain't that something? Because they didn't want to give it all. They were too busy hiding other things. Maybe they had other people, but they show like that intimacy with you, huh? I told you for some of y'all, you might need to be careful with this person too. This person, for some of y'all, this person may have gave you some type of STD too, because they are the Knight of Wands. Oof. All right, Spirit, why is this Knight of Wands here for Scorpio Spirit? Clarify this Knight of Wands. What's up with this Knight of Wands for Scorpio? Clarify, Spirit. Why is this here? Clarify the Knight of Wands for Scorpios. Knight of Wands. You walked away from them. Now, either you walked away from them or they walked away from you, but I feel like you walked away because you realized this person didn't have nothing to offer you, but that community won. <laughs> the community won and after you got done you realize they weren't gonna hug you <laughs> they weren't gonna sweep they won't unless they'll hug you if if y'all were gonna go for round two three four five six seven eight nine ten but i feel like for the most part this person was only the only only time they it's almost like the only time someone showed you that they were into you was into was when you guys were intimate that's what I'm getting because other than that, this person was concealing everything. So I know this person wasn't really showing. This person probably treated you with a, treated you. It's almost like the only time they felt, made you feel close is when you guys were intimate. But when you wasn't intimate, it's like you were one of the boys. <laughs> Maybe you was a friend. I just feel like this person pushed you away as soon as you got, the, the intimacy was the only thing that you got close to. Was the only thing that got you close to this person was when you guys were intimate here. But like I say, I feel like you're finding out that that's all it was. All right, Spirit, one more card for this King of Wands. See? There it is. It showed up in the reverse. The lover's card. See there? You found out that this person probably had other lovers out here, Scorpio. This person couldn't make up their mind. This is why they were in that night of wands. This is why they were hiding and being secretive. Because for some of y'all, this person had another lover here. And they wasn't in the best conditions either. This is relationship problems here too. So it's like they, they was in another relationship, but that wasn't even good. Because they probably was tired of their community one too, Scorpio. And for somebody, this person probably gave a lot of people STDs here too. No wonder you had to walk away from this person. And I can easily see it for somebody. Because this this is the ultimate betrayal right here. You probably tried to work with this person uh, over and over again. This is why this time come here, but spirit was like, you got to end this cycle here. And close out this cycle with this person because they're, they're no good for you. And I feel like now you're realizing for whoever this is for, you're so much better off now, now that you finally ended it. Now you can have a new beginning, a new direction, a new chapter, a new cycle here. Ooh, Scorpio. Now you got this Ten of Pentacles here. Spirit, why is the Ten of Pentacles here for Scorpios? Ten of Pentacles. Seven of Swords. Now see, you got the Seven of Swords on this side. I feel like somebody shortchanged you. Somebody was running away from a long-term relationship. See? Someone didn't have, you may have found out that they, that they were running from this connection. They, they didn't want it because you got the Knight of Wands. They're a runner. Ooh, Scorpio, see there? See, I don't like this. See, and I feel like you finally called it for what it is because check it out, the Knight of Wands. See, you finally had to go on and just say, you know what? This is too much. I, I see what's going on. Okay, I got you. You finally called this person out on their shit, Scorpio, and you moved on here. See, this is what you did. You was calling this person out on their stuff here, Scorpio. This person didn't want nothing. They were serious. They were serious about what they wanted, and it showed what no relationship. Oof. Look, this is what it is, Scorpio. Wow. Now, it's almost like 
If this is your extended Scorpio, it's almost like this is the same person, but when you left them, the first the first reading seems like that that is the after effect. This don't even seem like the extended. This seemed like what's going on before the first one here, because I feel like it's the same energy. Here, go to Hierophant on your side. I feel like this is all what happened at first, and the video that I did before is what's going to happen after here. This is almost like the past energy, what I feel like it is. All right, Spirit, why is the Hierophant here for Scorpios? The Hierophant, somebody feel defeated here. Or someone may have listened to a bunch of lies and stuff. This person could have had a lot of people telling them that they shouldn't get married here. It's almost like somebody, this person could have had a mother, a, a, a toxic mother interfering in. It's almost like someone listened to the, the thoughts of their mother here. And somebody was always wanting this person to do what was best that's going to make bring more success and more money here. Maybe this is the same energy with this Ten of Pentacles. Maybe someone was uh, stuck in some type of unhealthy, uh, they come from some unhealthy, uh, overbearing mother. She was all about money, not love. She didn't care about no, no love. If it didn't make money, it didn't make sense here. Ooh, Scorpio, clarify this higher fence spirit. Ace of Cups here. Wow, Scorpio. I feel like you feel like somebody just misled you and I feel like this is what you're recognizing spirit is really showing you a lot of things it's almost like someone just just, just sold you a dream Scorpio uh, and I feel like you feel defeated here because I feel like you was expecting this you was wanting this I feel like you just threw you just took the L and you just went in because I feel like this is what they did they manipulated you with the five of swords they ran the game with the five of cups and the knight of cups in the reverse uh, the Knight of, Knight of Wands uh, and the Lover's card in the reverse. This person was selfish. They were only out for a good time for whoever this is for. And I feel like you had your mind hoping that something could develop, but it never did. You realized that it wasn't going to happen with this person here, Scorpio. Mm -mm. Got the Six of Wands and the Eight of Wands. And so I feel like maybe what you're doing, did I see the Eight of Wands? I feel like you're just going to move on here. You're gonna, you're gonna, you you gain clarity, but you're not gonna move on uh, in a slump. You're gonna move on very victoriously, because after all, you do have happiness, perspective, and clear headspace. So yeah, you're gonna move on just fine here, Scorpio. Oof, Scorpio. Now let's check out your person here. Oof, this is a lot here, Scorpio. Now let's see. Spirit. Let's clarify Scorpio's person here, Spirit. What's going on with this person as it, as it relates to Scorpio? Why is the Seven of Swords here, Spirit? What did they do? What is the Seven of Swords here for Scorpio's person here, Spirit? Clarify the Seven of Swords for the, this person of Scorpio's. Seven of Swords. Four of Wands. They were stepping out on this connection. In other words, they were dodging this relationship. I feel like this is why they were not being honest because they didn't want what you want. They didn't want the commitment. See, they was leaving. They they was this person was running away or hiding from the connection. Like I say, like I feel like to see walking away. See, this person was emotionally not invested into this connection here, Scorpio. I feel like see they got the eight of cups too. You walked away from the, you physically walked away from this relationship, but I feel like this person. Never was emotionally invested here, Scorpio. And it could be for some of y'all, this person was hiding that they walked away, that they could have been hiding another relationship that they just ended here too, Scorpio. But you do have the four of wands in the reverse. So it could also represent that what they were being dishonest about is that uh, they already had some type of relationship going on that wasn't healthy. Because you remember, you got the lover's card on your side in the reverse, it's almost like maybe this person was stepping out on uh, another relationship here. So maybe they left you or walked away from you. Let's see, Spirit. Why is the Seven of Swords here for Scorpio's person? Spirit, clarify the Seven of Swords for Scorpio's person. Seven of Swords. 
Seven of Swords. Oof. Five of Cups here. They regretting it, though. Whatever this... I feel like... Okay, so this is what it is then. Queen of Swords. Because I feel like now they feel like you ain't trying to hear nothing now. This person was trying to avoid a commitment at all costs. But they wanted the they wanted the benefits of it, but they didn't want the commitment. And I feel like it's because this person wanted to be free and able to go date other people without being questioned and cuffed. It's almost like they didn't want to be tied down to one person. They could have also had uh, family members that was controlling their lives and had a lot of things to say about who they get involved with. Their family could have been very, very materialistic and very, very judgmental and uh, based on uh, clout and, and image here too. But I feel like this person is now regretting it. Now they're regretting all of the thing, all of the times that they walked away from this connection. Because once again, because see, they're... they're they're regretting the loss because they knew that they were hiding how they really felt. They were hiding. They were hiding that they just did not want to settle down with you for, for one. And number two, I feel like this person had more feelings for you than they let on because now they're regretting it because they're missing you. They're longing for you now. So now you have the will of fortune in the reverse. Here's the will is turned here. So now this person's receiving things are going, uh, things are not in their favor. This person's receiving a lot of bad luck. Things are not really uh, panning out for this person. I feel like, or they they feel like their world has just came crumbling down on them, Scorpio. And I feel like it's because you left, Scorpio. So let's see the will of fortune in the reverse for Scorpio's person. Will of fortune, see, Ace of Pentacles in the reverse, see. This person started started losing money opportunities here. So if this was somebody here who was all into money, because you got the Ten of Pentacles, if this was a money maker back in the day, their money is starting to be affected now. Their money is starting to be affected now, Scorpio. See, they're receiving karma here, and it's gonna get them where they hit. What see? And it, it's, it's, see, it's because of this Knight of Cups. I feel like if this person would have came in and honored you correctly, then everything would have been right. But they changed their destiny when they came in and they hustled you. But I feel like that Knight of Cups was in the uh, reverse. If they would have came in the right way, I feel like things would have been better. But I feel like, once again, this person was playing on your emotions. They didn't want to give emotions because you got the Knight of Cups over here in the reverse here on your side with the Ten of Swords. So see, they were emotionally manipulating. They wasn't emotionally invested. This is how they really should have came, wanting to offer love. But I feel like all they wanted was the lust here. So now they're taking L's all over the place, Scorpio. All right, Spirit, the will of fortune in the reverse for Scorpio's person. Why is this here, Spirit? Page of Swords, see? So this person here is watching you and I feel like this person's keeping tabs on you because it's almost like when this person worlds come crum crumbling down, they really could use some of your warmth, loving, vibrant energy, but you're no longer there. You were the sunshine in this person's life. I feel like you brought a lot of love to this person here, but they couldn't recognize it at the time because they didn't want what you want. So now that they're living with all this regret, all thing they can do is just watch you because they can't come back to you now anyway because things that fell apart and they like, I don't feel like they got it like that now, Scorpio. I feel like something has happened and I don't feel like they're going to tell you because this person's used to hiding things here too, Scorpio. So I just feel like you're going to find out about it. So let's see. You also have death. Now, why is this death card here for Scorpio's person now? See? See, it could have been somebody who was very financially able. And I feel like when they denied you this offer, it changed their destiny here. The will of fortune in reverse. I feel like when they denied you this, because I feel like they could have brought you a, a stable, solid offer here because you wanted new beginnings with this person because you got the ace of wands and you got the ace of cups. The ace of cups is in the upright. You still wanted this, but I feel like what you end up getting was this. 
I feel like you wanted love, but all they gave you this was this. And it would, for some of y'all, it really wasn't even that good. <laughs> and for some of y'all, it's burning, okay? For somebody, it's burning. I ain't going to say some of y'all. For somebody, it may have been burning. See, if they would have came in here with something serious, then I feel like they would have changed their own look. But because they came like this, then I feel like this person, now this person may be trying to figure out how to change it. They could be trying to, uh, you know, study. They could be trying to research or trying to um, figure out what can change their situation here. And then for some of y'all, they, they back watching you again. Because after all, they are longing for you. <laughs> they are longing for you, though, Scorpio. So, all right, Spirit, death is here for Scorpio's person. Why is this here? Death is, see? Ten of Pentacles in... Is that it's an up right here? So something ended here. Something ended because you got the Ten of Pentacles here. I feel like you ended it. I feel like what Spirit is telling this person, see, you were supposed to build something with Scorpio here. This was the purpose of it, but they didn't give you the opportunity to. They didn't give you the opportunity to. See the Ten of Pentacles? They were stepping out here. But I feel like you found out about it because you got the Hermit card. And I feel like after that, then you went on and you called the judgment. If this person wasn't wasn't going to, wasn't ready to settle down with you, they had other things in mind. They were very, very secretive. They were showing, they were doing. But I, like I said, I feel like you found out anyway because this Lover's card is in the reverse here. I feel like you did find this out. And this is why you finally made up your mind to go on and disconnect from this person. So now spirit is also spirit could also be saying now, now that you did Scorpio wrong, now there's going to be a death to, to, to your finances. Maybe there's going to be an ending to what they love. So, Ooh, I wonder what they talking about here. Scorpio. I know. Ooh, look. Two of cups. I see the two of cups here. Or maybe, maybe Spirit's saying there's a transformation that's about to happen here, Scorpio. See, because you got the Eight of Swords and the King of Pentacles again. See, there go that Knight of Wands. All right, Spirit, give me one more card for this death card here, Scorpio. Mm -mm. Could be a Virgo in here. All right, Spirit, clarify this death and this Ten of Pentacles for Scorpio's person. Could be a... a, a Mm. There's a lot going on over here. And your person got a lot to say now, Scorpio. Now that their luck has changed and things are not as picture perfect as they would want it to be. Because see, you got the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse on their side. All right, Spirit, why is the Death card and the Ten of Pentacles here for Scorpio's person? Mm. The Fool. That's in the reverse here. Is that in the reverse? Oh, yeah, that's in the reverse. See? Not taking no chances. I feel like you're saying uh, maybe it's the end of, of you two. I feel like it's the end of them. The moon card. Woo. You got Pisces, Pisces in here. I don't feel like there's a transformation. I just feel like there is an ending. I feel like what is about to happen is maybe this person was reckless with, I feel like this person was reckless with so much. It's almost like somebody had so much power, but they were reckless. They abused the power that they had. So it's almost like spirit is saying it's going to be the end of, of somebody's reign. Kind of, kind of like somebody was reckless because they had a lot of power here. Someone had a lot of power because they had a lot of wealth, but they were reckless with it. See, this wasn't a team player. Three of Pentacles in the reverse. They, they was only about themselves here. So I feel like Spirit is saying a lot of this is going to be, a lot of this is over here. I feel like this is why you left them. They're going to they're going to hire Finn again in reverse because you felt like, and it could be that this person ain't got no spiritual sound. There's no spiritual protection around them. It's almost like, I don't feel like there's a transformation. It could be a transformation going on, but I feel like it could be an ending to whatever this, this abundance that this person was, um, was in, uh, where am I looking for? Because this is risk. 
new beginnings here. It's almost like this person couldn't handle the responsibility of wealth. They abused the responsibility of worth because they were selfish, self-righteous. They was not a team player. They didn't believe in working with people. They were selfish here. This was a selfish person. And for some of y'all, I feel like there's an ending to this person's reign. I keep hearing it. If this person's used to having money in abundance, if they come from that, all of that is going to end. Because I feel like this is something, because I did see that empress in the reverse. It's something that is uh, generational and it's passed on down to this person. Almost like someone may have had a good life, but they've always been haughty. They've always abused their position because of the authority and the power that they had in their finances. It's almost like spirit saying that is about to end, that that reign is over. So you got the four of cups and the knight of pentacles in the reverse. Spirit, why is the four of cups here for Scorpio's person? Four cups, queen of wands. See, tell you they want that. I told you they like that. Now, see, I don't see no queen of cups. See, they don't want no queen of cups, but they show turned on by that queen of wands. And you, you see that? You see that? that see, that, that's why you left them to begin with. Because that's all they wanted was that. They didn't want the love. You see that, Scorpio? And you wanted love. And they got this twist. And they thought that this is all you wanted from them because you were just so good at it. You were just so good at just being such a passionate, fun person that they forgot that you had love too. See, this person is looking at you like, see, the lover, see? This person say you, they love her, Scorpio, because they say now you don't give a crap. They say now you don't care, Scorpio. Now, it could be that this person is, is feeling bad because maybe they chose another person. Here, Spirit, give me another card for this four cups for Scorpio's person. Because you got the lovers on the reverse over there. Two of Pentacles, see? Because this person couldn't make up their M and F and mind. We keep coming back to it. This person has somebody else, Scorpio. They had somebody else. And I feel like they were juggling but I feel like when you finally left this person is when their whole world came crumbling down here, Scorpio. I feel like this person was with you. They didn't want the emotion. They wanted the passion. But they also was juggling you with someone else because they weren't selling down there with, with them either. They were just going around giving a one. But you see what, what, what type of position is in. You see what type of condition it's in. Whew, now you got the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse for Scorpio's person. Spirit, why is this Knight of Pentacles in the reverse for Scorpio's person? Why is this here? Huh, because the knight of wands. See there? Because this person ain't trying to this person ain't trying to do nothing but give that wand. And then for some of y'all, this person may have be taking some type of illness here. Because I feel like somebody just keep on. Knight of Pentacles and upright is stable, solid, uh, is slow, be patient. In the in the reverse, ain't nothing happening. So, like I say, I feel like this person, their reign of, of, of abundance, of wealth, I feel like it's going to be tested or significantly delayed or taken from them. And you see this, they, they ain't going to be able to move around the same way because they ain't going to have no money. You see that this person, it's almost like the spirit was telling this person, you, you wasn't building and giving nobody nothing anyway, so you don't even need it here, see? Because all you're going to do is just use folks and then night of ones. You ain't giving nothing. All you're doing is taking. Ooh, somebody getting this, Scorpio. I'm telling you, somebody's receiving mad karma because of their ways here, see? This nine of cups because of their own indulgence. See, this person didn't care about nobody else. It was all about them. See, and they money, eight of pentacles. See, that's what it was. And they, they, all they did was entertain other people, but they wasn't going to commit to them either. This is the type of person that wants friends with benefits with this three of cups in the reverse because they, see, they, see, because they want to stay single so they can go meet other friends with benefits in this nine of M and F and pentacles. See, and that's why they ass is receiving karma today. See there? That's what it is, Scorpio. That's what it is here. See, all them, all them options they got, got their ass confused or they, or, or, or what has happened is they done drunk out the wrong cup for somebody because for somebody they done drunk out the wrong cup 
And they ain't the same now because they burning. And I'm telling you, somebody burning. I don't care. It may not be you, somebody, man, burning or exiting. And this is part of their karma because they wouldn't stop. It's like somebody just won't stop. It's almost like it's one thing to, 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 to be a selfish person when you have some so much. Or this could even be somebody who came from a very, very wealthy family, but they're privileged. I feel like this person wasn't taught nothing. They were given everything. They wasn't taught how to treat people or they just didn't care. It's almost like somebody spoiled somebody, but they didn't teach them no real life, life things here. So as a result, someone has acquired a lot of negative karma. And now that they messed around and met a Scorpio, they didn't mess around and met a Scorpio. Now their, their, their reign of success is over with the death card. God dang me. See? See, <laughs> see, see that this person, all they do is go destroy other relationships because they're not going to stick around long. Because like I say, it's all about them and the Knight of Wands and this Nine of Pentacles. But like I said, once again, Scorpio, this person thought they was everything. I tell you what, they ain't doing so good now. For somebody, this person is burning. They got some type of STD. That's what it is. But it's a good thing you done moved away from them, Scorpio, because you're going to be just fine, Ms. Scorpio. Oh, Scorpio, look, this is what it is. At least you got out, but I didn't know it was going to come out like this, but this is what it is, though. You're better off. You remember, you get the happiness perspective, clear the head space. You're better off here because you got new beginnings coming your way. It says new direction, fresh start, chance. See, you've closed out this cycle with this person here. Now they're finna receive their karma and they're receiving it. For some of y'all, this person probably went and had a baby too. See, this person probably feel like their luck has changed. You know, th that their money is not gonna be like they want to no more because now they got a whole responsibility here. Oh, Scorpio, see? Because like I said, it, like I say, they, 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 ain't, they ain't committing to nobody, but they also out here reckless too. That night of one's been out here reckless, Scorpio. So somebody got caught in their own devices here and they're paying and they finna be humble and ain't nobody gonna want them because for somebody, they, they burning anyway. Not only are they burning, but they gonna be a broke burning uh, in reverse one. <laughs> But you get away, though, Scorpio. Hallelujah, you get away. <laughs> All right, Scorpio, this is your reading. I'm going to do another reading. I won't want to be good. I'm going to try to make it short next time, Scorpio. But they just said, ooh, Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. So I guess Spirit is saying, be mindful. You got these people who won't. Especially if you got somebody that's, that's trying to come back to you and you know that they had a third party spirit, say don't sleep with them no more because they they they, they going through a lot of things. They, they keep a lot of secrets. They ain't going to tell you that they didn't. And for some of y'all, this person done got burned, but they ain't going to tell you, but they're going to try to come back to you and pick up where they left off. And spirit is just warning you, don't mess with them because even though they may have gotten, gotten got burned and may have taken their medicine, don't nobody want that. <laughs> I don't care how much medicine you took. Scorpio didn't put that on you. Don't bring that to Scorpio. Scorpio ain't here to nurse you. You Scorpio don't have Scorpio around here smelling like maggots. <laughs> and this person running around here leaking maggots with their nasty self. And they trying to act like they the boss. Oh, Scorpio, this is crazy. But that's how it be, Scorpio. All right, Scorpio. But this is your reading. So if it resonates, <laughs> it may resonate with somebody. Please like, share, and subscribe, Scorpio. Hit that notification bell, Scorpio. Leave me a comment, and I'll talk to you on the next Scorpio video. Bye, Scorpios.